Hey there everyone, this is Aokao playing Rakugaki Mario. Last time Greet Smooch, a level that I genuinely like. People had things to say, I genuinely like it. Now, this ghost house, Dream Gallery. Uh, Hiraga explicitly mentioned uh, a few days ago, when I Star World 7, that I should consider doing this one without, like, save stating or whatever. Let's, let's see what happens. Okay, well, it's a dream gallery, and here's our filter, except it's on filter now. But then I refiltered, so you'll always have a feather? It's Dolphin Zone. Here's a key. Your key needs a... Do you need a key? There we go. And what's here? A mushroom. Delicious. For me. Okay, so what is going to happen here, do you think? I have no clue. I wonder if this is gonna be... Dream Gallery. Everyone remembers VIP Dream Castle, right? Yeah, okay. So there's a real possibility that if I die, where I end up is not the same. You gotta do that. Here. Okay, yeah, this is pretty smart, actually. Right, I'm gonna deposit this here. There we go, because once I jump up to hit the switch, I'm on the other side! But the turtle could have been in the way and caused problems, but he's not, so it's all good. Alright, um, hmm. Do you think those dolphins are safe? Not like that. Okay. <laughs> Mighty leap, kinda. Mighty big leap here, then throw it up and vomit everywhere. Gross. Do I want to be on the other side? Something tells me that I do, but why? How would you get past you, though? To go like, yeah! Okay. So far, so good. I lost a key. That's fine. Yeah, see? You need to be on the other side. That's where you bomb the key, maybe. No. No, yeah, how does this work? Because I can't go underneath there. If I bomb this... See, now I'm on the other side and I can't return. Okay, I can't go in this pipe, no, I just take the hit. Hey, it's clear that there's an aspect of this puzzle here that I did not- Oh, you get- Maybe you are supposed to just chug the key upward all this time. Okay. Dream gallery, though. I just had a dream. What does that mean? Gonna go in this pipe. Uh, Sight unseen. Oh, it's this generator. Terrible. All right, so Let's keep playing until I find a path. That's nice to me uh, All right, let's see, here we go. So this kind of- oh, that was unfortunate All right, this like half uh, Not ha Yeah, it is half a wrap. It's just like it's, the, the halves are not like connected. It's still half. Don't hit these That's a trap they want to block you up, but scrolling's pretty slow, so you're probably gonna notice. All right, so here we go, my leap. Okay, single skull now. Here we go, single skull adventure. Now available on Macromedia Flash. Okay, so we got to wait. I hate waiting here though. It's scary, you know. Bats are here. Fur is blue instead of green. They don't look nearly as much like parrots. Here we go. Yeah, this is. Feels kind of wonk. All right, then we do that, and then jump that shell. Could be a bad corner. I don't know. It could be. Whoops! I forgot to rethrow upward. Oh 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 oh! We're swimming. All right. So you give me this P switch here. What does that mean? I mean, it's a P switch. You can use it to bot blocks and you know trigger P switch type events. All right, so we're swimming, dead fish. We're gonna go back, right? We're gonna go all over to a place. So it's possible this P-Switch here is strictly supposed to be a swim a little faster machine, which I appreciate. A little bit of a floater. You know, feel that float, as they say in Amsterdam, probably, if in the right conditions, for that it makes sense to say. Oh, I'm trying to go right in between the scale of fish and I did it and that didn't feel on purpose. It's fine. Here I am 
swimming along, forgetting words of the song. The song I'm just inventing as we speak. What ba bi ba ba bi boo? Yeah, how does this work? Okay, no, yeah, I see how this works. So we're gonna we're gonna press the switch. We're gonna go like Papo. Then we're gonna press this switch. Then we're gonna move through time and space. Oh, but now it's gonna be an old school. Changing everything. Yeah, that actually is gonna change a lot. This, okay, so did you remember this level well? I don't know about well. I don't know about at all. I play that super badly. Wow. Oh, that's how I did that the first time, and why I didn't think about it afterwards. Uh, well, so, what does this mean? It means that I'm not able to hit that one switch in the end, but, like, I still can just tank a hit, assuming I just don't get a hit on the way there. Like, it's not the end of the world, unless there's one in here. Oh, you get an extra key here. Super weird, isn't it? Oh shoot, I'm mis- okay. How? This is how I suggest you do this part. Have the cape from earlier on and do that. Uh, that guy freaked me out, that's fine. You're gonna get freaked out sometimes. So see here, once you cross this rope, there's no way around it. Right, like you're, you're, you're in this system. So I'm gonna do that, and I'm not gonna grab it. Can you not grab it in that instance? I guess not. I don't know. I'm, I'm a bit worded out. Uh, so this guy has a face. Accurate, unfortunately. Ah, okay, so I managed to hide. That's good. Hiding is good. Where do I want to go from here? Okay, I can totally, super totally land on you from here. All right. Big jump, because I don't know where anything is. Oh, hi there, penguin farm. You guys are having fun. There's a ceiling, too? Where's... Oh. Oh, there's... I did not see you guys up there. Hidden by the HUD. Very sneaky. Um... This is not my favorite allegory for... I should have tried to toss my, my, my key upwards. That's what I should have tried to do. I didn't- I, by the time I thought about it, I was already molten. Boppo. As a sound I make, Boppo. A fish is looking at me, Boppo. Please get scrolled off the screen. Wow, that was brilliantly played. Oh, and I didn't get the mushroom. Alright. I'm a little bit bummed that, like, this part seems a lot of interesting, but it's like, you know, it's after the somewhat more tedious swim there normally. Whoops. Nah, it doesn't matter. Or does it? No, it doesn't. Alright, I'm more in front of the stream, that's not gonna last at all. So, cool. Alright, so. So, I'm here now. I'm dead now. Oh. Well, I'm glad it's not being noisy. How about that? Whoa, jump, please. Oh, but it's okay. The blog does not know what's happening. Fart. Well, you know what? The beauty of life. Schnut. Well, I'm dead. Yeah, see, this is... Fart. Okay. This is why we have a key here, I think. It's to be able to hit these more easily. English. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, well... I don't know. I feel like they were appearing in bad patterns, and I went for it when I shouldn't have went for it. Like, that's what it boils down to. Hey, cave. It's been a bit. Why did I 
not have a cape here when I was playing this the first time? Did I just get hurt, like, real early in a dumb way? Like, that sounds like what would have happened, but I genuinely do not remember. Because, like, I remember, like, how tricky position of a lot of the plants were. Ah, uh, I can't. Just have to take the hit here. Like here, you get all these plants, you know, it's like very awkward, but here everything was placed pretty nice. So, I don't know. I don't know. Alright, I'm safe. <laughs> They're not- I did not stem check. Oof. I'm good. Do I just go here? Maybe. I just went. Alright! I saw more or less every wow every level. So I feel oh I thought you were going to hop and instead I fumbled about. So what does it mean to have been so I get I'm assuming that's just like one of the three stages. One of them is pipes. Yeah, the other one is woods. Oh, it's woods on a bubble. Bubbly woods. Everyone's full of soda. No, what? Why? What does that have to do with anything? I don't know. Don't worry. Oh, I guess I was still ascending. Wait, wait. That was very short. Um. What does that mean? Oh, but it's not over yet, though. So maybe now it's like short micro rooms. Oh, this is happening. Okay. All right. Well, okay. I should be fine here. You're gonna get down, and I'm gonna do a big leap. Yeah, it's Rex. Have we seen any Rex in this game until now? Oh, Rex, you try very hard. Hey, I am rewarded for being tiny. So there I knew that stepping against a wall would give me, you know, an appropriate uh, place that I could jump up because it's a tile-based system game, right? Everyone knows that. Alright, hey there, Mr. Mole, running on your spikes, yo! It's kind of like the lava thing that I just did. I gotta destroy this man, but I was supposed to spin jump. I would have had a proper bounce, but I didn't think about it on the spot. Yeah, so... Ugh. My assumption was that Pipe Lord Land was gonna be, like, relatively short and immediately bought me somewhere else. I didn't make it that- like, that is genuinely pretty hard, I feel like? Like, the timing there that's required? Uh, I don't know. Me? I don't know? Well, I get another try, so... Listen, hell, I have no idea what are your rules for when you stretch out or not. I guess, no, yeah, I know this. When you're against the edge of the screen, the game thinks you're against, like, both edges. The screen is pretty stupid. That's what it boils down to. Is it gonna be a muncher run? No. It's gonna be a P-switch something. My P- I don't know where I want it, so let's put it vaguely half in and see what happens from there. Uh, gonna wait it to go. Here, that guy's gonna, you know, good for him. But maybe this is one of those levels we're supposed to run with. No, see, this is it. Then if you're here small, you can eat. Wait, I, I just, just go in. Oh, good. P-switch. Oh, slight regrets. Now I wonder if this is where, like, the secret exit is hidden. Like, you get the door or you continue. Like, each of these has two ways to go. Well, I can see my big red butt. I don't know where to go here. In this pipe, maybe? Nope. Up here, maybe? No. Yeah, I don't know what you want from me. Well, that's unfortunate. I mean, there's a P-switch, but there's a P-balloon. There's something. But what's the something? I don't know. Maybe we need to go back. Ooh, this is new. Turtle platform with lines and saws. Oh, crossfire. I don't miss you. Like, I was just going to say that, ugh, I haven't seen you in a while. 
But then, like, I automat- See, once again, it continues, but... Not enough, like, hide something major. I don't know. Maybe it's just for the- Maybe it was just for the Dagadon. Okay, so this is- Yeah, this is falling. Generated Super Koopas in a weird cave While it sinks in a blueberry rave There's a bone infested with munchers What you gonna do about that? I don't know, maybe I'll cry Maybe I'll survive Maybe I'll ride a play Whoa, that was pretty scary And then I paid That's unfortunate Cause see, I, I, I wanna feel out, you know, where Where can I go here? But Ugh, but then, you know, uh, really, really, and then there I super balance on the Super Koopa. This would be fantastic without the spike ceiling, I think. Spike ceiling. Why? Yeah, this is by far the easiest one. But see, there's that Dagadon there, you know? Like, what does that mean? Is there a low-flying eerie you can hitch a ride on? Because that's not low-flying. Oh, there's a second bubble entirely. Ah. Next time I'm here, I kind of want to maybe put a save and test that out. <laughs> ah, but I'm here. But I mean, is it fair to make the exit happen on only like one out of three paths? Well, one of the Luigi's Adventure from Anna Kitty has a thing where... To get a secret exit, it's a one out of three chance, and I don't think the level really advertises it beyond a normal exit. Sending you on an infinite loop on a map, right? I think? So... Uh, it's possible that the secret exit is luck-based. Like, I hope it's not. I don't necessarily expect it will. But I guess what I'm saying is that it, it can. Alright, so, yeah, I don't I don't know how I feel about any of this. Uh, shoot. See, this, I think you need to build up there, right? Yeah, you need to fill up there. Okay. I, th I feel like this is just a thing you learn. It's fine. It's just that you don't always play this level. So you just kind of rush there, and you're good. If one of these is a secret, it could be any pipe, you know? Like, that's, that's valley. All right, you. So, here, don't stress out. I guess there's a world where, no, there's a wall of coins at the end. You can't bring that further than this. Now, I guess there's not, it's not impossible that you might need to, like, there's another blue door that appears somewhere. I don't know, maybe what I want to do is just bring this with me and have fireballs in the next section, which is going to be a powerful tool, assuming I can keep it. Because I can just burn Rex instead of timing spin jumps. It's just that now, though, like, I do need to make it the way there, which is not free. It is not guaranteed. Ah! Especially when a jump doesn't jump. Why didn't you jump? So you get a nice healthy boost when you spin jump on these. Alright. Here we go. Video games, yo. Why'd you say that? I don't know. It's marketing. You know, for that video games, yo, merchandise that exists. It probably exists, probably unrelated to me. Alright, so, think fast. Mole time. Here, you gotta go like, hey, there's a mole. And it's mine. So here there's a you, then there's you I gotta get rid of. That's fine. You can dance a little bit, you know? It's gonna evaporate and you're gonna stop freaking out. It's Mega Mole. You did it. You lived through the ordeal of there's a block that exists there. What are you gonna do about it? Scream and dance. This is how I express all my feelings. Okay, I just kind of did a jump. Oh, well. So, you are supposed to just kind of go. But then, you know, then I hit, uh, Fart? Okay. Yo, yo, yo! Welcome to Cream Cheese Heaven. The heaven for cream cheese. Beep ba beep boo I'm in the sky! Is the secret exit- Hey, it's this setting. Is the secret exit getting the Dagadons? 
I mean, it's not impossible. This level is super cool! I didn't beat all the segments. I don't know if I will. Oh, there's the key. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Up and down, what does that mean? What does that mean? Do I need to do something? Is it getting the Dagadons? Is there a Dagadon per segment or two or something? I don't- I- I guess I'll- I'll save scum my way through getting Dagadons. How about that? You could- For sure? Uh, let's try flying around here and see if I can uncover any mysteries. Huh? So really, all you do is you panic a little bit. This is it. This is all you have to do. <laughs> this is all you have to do! Here's a door, and then there's more beyond. Yeah, see? Oops, uh, do you think I'm doomed? Yeah, because you need to throw that there. Got it. Well, look at that. I planned the road. See, look how much work you need to put into getting the Dagadons. Like, I think that is super suspicious. Well, yeah, I guess suspicious is a word you can use. Alright, dude. Whoops. Alright, so, that there, so you can get this here. So I can, like, just throw that there. There we go. One uno dagado. Uh, how do I get out? Whoa! Can I just go over? I don't think so. Because if I do that, I just die. Feels like super bad and wrong. Ugh. Alright, 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 alright. Get me out. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Alright. So, there's a Dagadon in every world. So here you're gonna make it, me do it the fun way. Good. Uh, I appreciate it. Ooh, that's interesting. So if you don't die, don't return to hub space, you keep your stuff. I kind of want to see if I can keep this cape. It's very useful when you're doing things like this, you know? Jumps. Oh, jumps. <laughs> I'm bad at this game sometimes, but sometimes I'm okay. The trick is to try and land in the middle. Alright, so. That's the sound you make. Look at that. Look how much effort you need to go to get there. Ridiculous. Oh, that's. Oh, that's a traversal pipe. That's funny. Yeah, so you don't need to put this door set up twice. Okay, let's hope for the stage that's not. It's new one! Well, perfect. Okay. Um. So I guess I'm gonna cheat my way through this one. When I put a save there, maybe we can. Okay, it's a go through the crumbular. Welcome to Crumble Town. Did I want to bring a duck? Ducks are pretty swell. Quack! See, I said quack, because there's ducks. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna get this mushroom and I'm gonna eat it. Stuff my face. You gotta warp through the bowling ball. The wall is moving back and forth. I got a cape from the end of the universe so I can just whack you away. Now I can get this dagger done and climber my way away. Alright, see, then I'm gonna go back, do a little bit of this, check if there's anything here. There isn't. What am I looking at here? Oh, I did it. Oh, shoot. Yeah, so you're supposed to probably destroy you thusly, and then you can go like pop, 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 and pop, pop, pop. That's right. Alright, well, I'm capeless now. Whoa, I did not expect to be like, bring apart to the s Shoot, I was testing! <laughs> I didn't know what end would work. I wonder if both end would work. Yo. I mean, here both- Yeah, see, greens typically only one side works. That's what I've learned during like, jump games, right? I guess I wasn't sure which side was going to work. I just tried one way earlier than was of any use. As you do. Right. It's like the easiest Dagon on the whole level. It just so happens to be in this level. That's pretty good. 
Alright, so, uh, 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 no, 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 uh, oh, you know what? Made in time. It's all good. Check it out, I'm Kate. Check it out, I am fancy. I'm gonna keep one of you alive to tell the tale of Mario. Then my tinnitus kicks and then it hurts my ears like wow we -o. I'm here. Did I miss a Dagadon? Or like, like how does that work? Well, that's unfortunate. Trying these pipes. Yeah, did I miss a Dagadon? Like, where the, the secret exit would be? It's like I'm missing a segment. Am I supposed to still be flying? This hole is in the mysterious warp. Hmm. I mean, it's possible I might have missed a dragon coin, I guess. I want to be able to fly. In case you need to, like, do something with flight. Oh, you need to move in the unstuck pipe. Alright. I mean, I can fly. Wait, can you fly underneath? Are these walls semi-solid? <sighs> they are. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. So the actual puzzle is basically beat. I mean, shoot. This is hard. Um, but still, like, so the challenge is, in essence, beat the level without dying. Like, I think that's what this means. Because you get a cape in the very first HUD. Oh, wow, alright, okay, no, no, can okay, this work? Yeah! Check it! Oh, wait, still gotta go, whoops, I found that in the clouds. Alright, well, uh, uh, eh, uh, eh, uh, eh, uh, eh, uh, eh, uh. Wait a second, what are you showing me here? Okay, was I supposed... I think I'm supposed to still be flying flying. I can do that. It's something I know how to do. It's not the easiest thing in the world. But, like, I think, like, the intent was that you would, like, fly up, get the key from below, which would you, which would set you up for this. Okay, I'm starting to run out of time, actually. Okay, alright. How hard is this gonna be? Right, I'm gonna put a save here before I start to fly, just because I don't know how many times I'm gonna have to redo that, because this is difficult. Like, this is genuinely not the easiest thing to do in the world. There we go. So I don't know how many people know about this glitch, but I had to learn this glitch in 2008 or so, so honestly, this feels appropriate. So as you know, normally if you fly holding an object, you're just kind of flying straight up and, sl and straight down. You don't have bubble physics. But if you grab an object while you are in bubble physics, you retain bubble physics. And so you can bubble and dive and all that fun st stuff. I think this was required here, mind you. Like, I don't actually know. What are you telling me here? Can you turn around? Or not? Oh, crud, Barneys. All right. Wow, I'm surprised how well I can recreate this, though. Oh, but then I lost it. I'm glad I have quick, easy access to saves on my controller. Curious to know what's in that door, too. I might put. Oh, okay, I thought I lost it. The thumb that's in charge of slamming down on the jump and Y button. Kind of hurting a lot. So, this. I'm, I'm not trying on purpose here. I want to, well, you know what, I can put a safe here. I'm pretty high up, and it'll be easier to turn around and fly back to the keyhole from this position. But I want to see if there's anything here in this door. Like, I'm just kind of curious. Do it, do it, do it. 
Ah, hey, Dagadons! It came back. So that's how you get all the Dagadons, if this is something you care about. Okay, I'm just gonna reload. What, what, no, okay. So this, I think it's a 50-50? On turning around? Oh boy. Okay, maybe I do want to be further back then. I can arrange that. I can arrange that. Alright, okay, there you go. So yeah, just give yourself enough space and don't make it quite high enough still. Yeah, these are all intended mechanics from Nintendo, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> This is clearly the pose game. Like, we're gonna go to the star world and then we're gonna go through that zigzag we opened up. And then, I mean, we know, right? So, no, next time we do the steps necessary to get to the end of the real game. We are, we're kind of getting in there. I'm kind of curious to check it out, but like, I don't know if it'll trap me or something. This is the level of, um, trust I have. <laughs> like, I doubt it, but. I'm not, I'm not taking any chances.